Welcome back, uh, Patriots. Welcome to Sons of Liberty 1773. I'm your host, Bill Bailey. Um, folks, if you notice, every time the Democrats can be, um, uh, accuse uh, the Republicans or Trump of something, <clears throat> they're found not guilty. But as time goes by, we find out the Democrats are, are guilty of exactly for exactly of what they're accusing the other side of. And here we go again. Um, busted. Vice President Biden took classified documents, okay, and stashed them. Um, it is, uh, I think it was his uh, pen office that would have said, um, uh, you pen office. Um, <clears throat> so um, the vice president does not have the power to declassify. Um, remember, uh, Secretary of State Hillary Rodham Clinton destroyed thousands of documents that were under subpoena, nothing, right? Uh, so now Joe Biden is found with illegal documents. He shouldn't have possessed them. They're classified. Uh, remember this, folks, not that long ago. Remember that? Unprecedented raid on a former president's estate for garbage. I mean, they had no reason to go there other than apparently they wanted to go through Melania Trump's panty drawer. Um, they broke into his house. They, they, um, I think they planted evidence. They staged a photo. Uh, but it was, there's, Trump did nothing wrong. Um, the, the documents he had, he had the power to de declassify. He's president. Um, so this, these are at post, over at postmillennial.com. Um, let me find it here. Uh, breaking classified docs from Biden's time as vice president discovered in his UPenn office. The materials were identified by personal attorneys for the president on November 2nd, just days before the midterm elections. <clears throat> Excuse me, folks, I'm still dealing with some allergies. Um, a Chicago attorney has been assigned by U.S. Attorney General Merrick Garland to review classified documents, keyword classified documents found at the Biden uh, Penn Center for Diplomacy and Global Engagement in Washington, reports CBS News. This relates to about 10 documents that were not declassified uh, from P President Biden's um, vice presidential office, two, two sources uh, said. Uh -uh, the materials were identified by personal attorneys for the president on November 2, just days before the midterm elections. According to special counsel to the president, Richard Sauber, the documents were discovered when Biden's personal attorneys were packing files housed in a locked closet to prepare to vacate office space at the Penn Biden Center in Washington, D.C. Uh, ha! Uh, so are they going to raid? Um, matter of fact, Trump brings up this question. Let's go over here. Trump demands DOJ raid White House after discovery of Biden's holdings. Uh, Biden was holding classified documents in his U.S. Penn office. I think it's important to note these were taken when he was VP. I mean, this is illegal, folks. It's a crime. Uh, wow, the Biden think tank is funded by China. Also, a VP cannot declassify documents which are covered by the Federal Records Act, which is criminal and much tougher than the Presidential Record Acts, which is not criminal, Trump uh, said on a truth he posted. On Monday, former President Donald Trump asked when the FBI was going to raid the homes of Joe Biden, including the White House, in response to the revelation that Biden kept classified documents from his time as v vice president in his think tank's office. Trump said on Truth Social, when is the FBI going to raid the many homes of Joe Biden, perhaps even the White House? Uh, these documents were definitely not declassified. Uh, so great point, huh? So, um, you know, and here was the article back then, Trump's Mar-a-Lago home search by FBI. Uh, it was an unprecedented move and it was disgusting. Uh, really, another move by the uh, criminal FBI. So, um... What do you think, folks? Are they going to do anything about this? I mean, this is a crime. The vice president took uh, classified documents. Hit them. 
I mean, we're just finding them, right? Um, guilty of exactly what they accused Trump of, which Trump was not guilty of. Um, Fed's going to show up at um, Biden's house and kick the doors in, demand everybody walk out, shut off the cameras, start going. They're probably not, not, not interested in going through Jill's panty drawer, to be honest. <laughs> Living in a sad times, my friends. So let me know what you think in the comments down below. I uh, love hearing from you. Keep the faith, patriots. Remember, we never retreat. Uh, we're always moving forward. Prayers for um, uh, Diamond's family. You know, Diamond of Silk passed away. I guess she'd been sick since um, Thanksgiving. It's really a loss. Truly a patriot and a Christian person. Uh, and no doubt she is, she is with the Lord. Uh, but prayers for her family. Um, that's it. I'll see you. I got... Um, one other quick video I want to make, and then I've got to run, uh, I got to go for a little drive. So uh, I'll see you in the next video.